Hi, we're inside the uh, rather cosy interior of the Stanway from Auto Sleepers, and we're on the Broadway Caravan Club site. This is a six metre van conversion from Auto Sleepers. It's based on the Peugeot Boxer and with all the trimmings in the cab, it's got a 150 brake horsepower engine, which is 20 brake horsepower more than the standard. And it's got quite a roomy layout for a six metre van. And one of the key features that Auto Sleepers adds is uh, Alco's air top air suspension, which just helps uh, smooth out the ride quite a bit. The Boxer is a nice easy vehicle to drive, controls fall easily to hand, they're all very positive, the gear change is particularly slick, there's a nice dab stereo, there are controls on the steering wheel itself, you've got Bluetooth so you can hook up to your phone and handling's pretty good as well. The living area is this uh, rather interesting double dinette which can also be U-shaped and the key thing about it is you've got not just all this floor space in front of you but slide back this uh, the sliding door and you've got the uh, a view of the world the stanway is actually packed with goodies you've got your uh, tv connections here truma heating and hot water system there's loads of led lighting everywhere and there's also a really good level of storage it's um, a really roomy kitchen for, a, don't forget, this is just a van conversion and a, and a six metre long van conversion at that. But as you can see, Auto Sleepers have put in a decent cooker, three ring hob with a combined oven and grill. There's a corner sink here. There's not quite enough space for a drainer, which is a little bit surprising because I think they could have got away with it if they tried. There's a coffee maker, it's a bit of a gimmick maybe, a microwave oven, some good storage up above, and uh, the fridge alongside, and also, a little bit of slide out extra worktop. Right, we'll slide back the door and voila, it's the washroom. It's got a swivel bowl toilet, it's got a fixed sink in the corner and it's got a shower which to me is set a little bit too far back but uh, you can enclose the whole room off and that's your shower cubicle. And there's also a handy vanity unit and a towel holder just there. And this is the bed, fully made up. As you can see, it's not the biggest, but it's pretty wide, and there's also space to get outside to the door or through to the toilet from here as well. So um, that, that works quite well. I think there's still some work to be done on it, but it's, uh, it's, it's a good idea, it's a good concept. And I think anyone over six foot is really gonna struggle with this, to be honest, but um, it's still in the development stage, so maybe there some, are some improvements to come.